How to fix Bluetooth not working on your Asus VivoBook. So whether the Bluetooth icon is just missing altogether or you're having issues connecting one of your Bluetooth devices, I'm going to show you a couple of troubleshooting steps to go and fix this issue. Now the first solution is to open up the start menu, search for the word settings and click on this window. In the left hand side, select Bluetooth and devices and then you should see an option here called Bluetooth. Now obviously make sure this is turned on and enabled. You can then click on add device and you can select Bluetooth to begin connecting your device. Now if that's not working or you don't see Bluetooth in this list, what you'll need to do is open up the start menu, search for the word services and click on this window here. You then need to scroll down until you see the Bluetooth support service. So we're just going to double click on this, make sure the startup type is set to automatic and make sure the service status is set to running and then you can press apply and OK. Now if that's not working, you can also right click on the Bluetooth support service and just go and press restart. Now, now once you've done that, you can check to see if it solves the issue. If that's not working, open up the start menu, search for device manager and click on this window here. You can then click on the drop down arrow next to Bluetooth and you should see your Bluetooth adapter. Now just go and right click on the adapter and press uninstall device. You can then press uninstall. Now once you've uninstalled this, you'll need to right click on Bluetooth and select scan for hardware changes. And once again, you can check to see if Bluetooth is now working. Now if you've tried all of these steps and you're still having an issue, the last solution is just to perform a soft reset. Now to do this we need to make sure our computer is turned on and then we're simply going to hold down the power button for around about 30 seconds. So even when the power goes off and the screen goes black you're going to continue to hold this power button down for 30 seconds. After 30 seconds you can go and release the button, you can then try turning your laptop on and that should have now solved the Bluetooth issue. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.